Today I'm going to be showing you guys what I typically eat in a day. I obviously don't eat this every single day, but it will give you some healthy meal ideas. I just woke up. It's currently 7.05 in the morning and I usually eat breakfast almost right away. So we're going to go make some breakfast after I make my bed. That's always the first step. Let's go make some breakfast. So for breakfast, I decided to make oatmeal. I make this almost every single morning. It's just the perfect breakfast for me. So I always do a half of cup of oats. So I'm just using two one fourth cups here. And then I use almond milk as my liquid. I've tried many different recipes of oatmeal, but this one has just always been my favorite. So I use half an apple, so I'll cut those up into like little cubes. And then I'll grab a banana. This is like a key ingredient because I feel like it just makes the oatmeal like stick together, but I'll only use half of it and I'll mash it up and then put it in my oatmeal. Then I'll grab some cinnamon and chia seeds. These are also very important and I'll just, I don't really measure, I kind of just eyeball it. For the toppings, I like to use slivered almonds, peanut butter, and maple syrup. So I'll just do like a pinch of the almonds, a spoonful of peanut butter, and then I'll just do like a half a tablespoon of maple syrup. And I always like to have a glass of almond milk with my breakfast. It just hits different in the morning. Ready? Here's the gym fit for today. We have this cute pink set from Gymshark. This is like one of my favorite sets ever. It's so adorable. Okay, time for the best shake ever. So we just have a Nutribullet, but obviously you can use any blender. But I'm telling you, this is the best protein powder ever. It's from Women's Best and they have so many different flavors and kinds of proteins. We'll just do a handful of spinach. I promise you can't even taste it. And it's so, so good for you. Then I will grab some yogurt and almond milk. So I will just do a serving size of yogurt, which is three fourths a cup and then one cup of almond milk. It just makes the perfect ratio, I feel like. let's do a taste test. I usually use dairy-free yogurt, like coconut yogurt, but they didn't have any at the store. I am not dairy-free, but I'm trying to slowly like stop eating dairy. Oh my gosh. This is the best shake ever. You guys have to try this, I'm telling you. It is time for lunch. It is currently 12.27. I'm not sure what I'm gonna make, but we'll see. So for lunch, I decided to make hummus pizza. This is one of my favorite meals ever. So you can use any bread for this. Yesterday, I actually just used like two slices of bread and made hummus toast instead, and it turned out really, really good. My favorite toppings are red onions, black olives, and spinach. And then you can either put it in the oven, or for me, this is just easier putting it in the toaster, but I'll just leave it in for like five to 10 minutes. And then after, I'll drizzle some balsamic glaze on it. This really makes it a 10 out of 10. 
I also added some of my favorite fruit on the side, some strawberries, grapes, and pineapple. So I just ordered a few things from Starlight Village and it came. I already like unboxed it for my TikTok, but I still wanted to show you guys. So first thing I got is this smiley ring. It is adorable. All their rings are adjustable, which I love. So I decided to put it on my pinky. Look how cute. And then the next thing I got is a set. So it comes with this necklace that says grateful. And look how cute the packaging is. So cute. And then it also came with a ring. Just a gold ring that also says grateful. I just think it's a perfect reminder to look and you'll be like grateful and just remember to be grateful for something. I think that's a really like important message and I'm gonna wear it all the time so that I remind myself to be grateful. The last thing I got is this smiley necklace. I've been looking for one of these. It was only $10 and it's so cute and it's literally just what I was looking for, so I'm very happy with that. This will probably be like my everyday necklace. I'll put it on for you guys. But I'm literally obsessed, guys. I've been wanting rings forever. I put it on. I am obsessed. It is literally adorable. I'll link Starlight Village down below so that you guys can check out the shop. And everything is so reasonably priced. So for a snack, we are having some protein waffles. I actually saw my sister make this and it looks so good, so I had to try. So I just toasted two waffles and then topped it with almond milk whipped cream and then added some strawberries and bananas to it. And then I finished it off with some maple syrup. It was so delicious. So that was actually my first time having like those waffles. I found a cream, yeah, made with almond milk, so it's dairy free. I found that at the store yesterday. It was actually really, really good. So if you're dairy free and you haven't heard of that yet, definitely try it. I just topped it with strawberries and bananas. That is like the best waffle combination, I feel like. And then for dinner, my family made some pasta with veggies, so I decided to put some onions and zucchini in my pasta, and then I made my favorite garlic bread, so I'll just use wheat buns and put some olive oil, salt, pepper, and garlic powder on it. Okay, so we're gonna see how many times we can hit the volleyball back and forth. It's probably gonna be really bad. Can they see me? We got four on our first try. Let's try again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, thirteen. Oh, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. We got eighteen. Very much improvement from the first time. Change of sport, now we are playing basketball. Go ahead, shoot one. I'm gonna really miss it. Air ball. If you didn't know, I played basketball for like pretty much my whole life and now I suck. So I'm gonna show you my moves. Still got it. <laughs> and I always want something sweet after dinner, so this is my go-to snack. I'll just grab some almonds, craisins, and dark chocolate, and just make like a trail mix almost. That is everything I'm eating today. I hope it gave you some meal ideas or inspired you in some way. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I post every single Sunday. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.